Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this tutorial, I will show you 5 tips for crochet beginner. First tip, choose the crochet hook for your yarn. Usually, the number of crochet hook is written on the label. Here you have the number for the needles and the number for the crochet hook. If your yarn doesn't have a label, you can choose a crochet hook with the thickness close to the thickness of the yarn. Like this. Second tip. Chain stitch. Chain stitch is the basic stitch in crochet. Make a loop on the crochet hook. Hold it with two fingers. Hook the yarn and pull it through the loop. I usually make three stitches before dragging the yarn. One, two, like this. And I continue. Third tip, single crochet stitch. Place the crochet tip in the second chain from the crochet hook. One, two. You have two loops on the crochet. Cling the yarn, pull it through the chain. Let's do it again. One, two. Pull the tip in the second chain, cling the yarn, sorry, cling the yarn, you have two loops, and now cling again and pull it through the both of them. This is your first single crochet. Let's do it again. Okay, you have two loops, cling the yarn, again two loops, And now through the both of them. Repeat. Fourth tip turn for another row. For another row, on the end of the last one, you make a chain stitch, like this. Turn and start with the single crochet stitch in the second chain from the hook. The fifth. The fifth is the yarn tension. We have three kinds of tensions, tight, normal and loose. When you work tight tension, the yarn is too stretchy, the stitches is difficult to do and your fingers tire quickly. The work will be smaller. It's the most common for beginners to work tight. In time, you will find the right way for you. Just practice. Let's see. 
The green sample is worked at my normal tension. If we compare the two samples, we see that the same number of stitches, different tensions, we have different size. Normal tension. In the normal tension, the yarn is the proper tension. The stitches is easy to make. The work look uniform and nice. After you practicing for a while, you will find the normal tension. loose tension. For this, I keep the index finger very loose. Let's see what is the difference between the three samples. We have same number of stitches, but the dimensions are different. It is important to maintain the same yarn tension from the beginning to the end. But you will get this after some practice and exercise. So don't give up. If you like this tutorial and find it useful, please click like and subscribe. For questions or suggestions, leave a comment. Thank you for watching my channel.